The M2 MacBook Air has been out for a little while now and I absolutely love this machine. However, it's missing a few things that a couple of accessories might solve. So today I'm going to go over some of my favourite accessories that I use with the M2 MacBook Air. Hello everyone, my name's Mike and here at Sabrent we love to make and talk tech. So if that's what you're into, then make sure to hit that subscribe button and notification bell so you can stay updated with all our future videos. The M2 MacBook Air only has two Thunderbolt ports and a MagSafe port meaning that coming from a 14-inch MacBook Pro, I'm missing out on an HDMI port and a UHS-2 card slot. This is where the Sabrent Travel Thunderbolt dock comes in handy because it has a UHS-2 card slot, which is fantastic for UHS-1 and UHS-2 cards from V30, V60 or V90 cards. It's also got a USB 3.2 USB type A port, which is capable of delivering up to 10 gigabits per second. We then have a gigabit ethernet port, which is fantastic for a stable internet connection. And then on the side, we have an HDMI port and a display port as well. So by using the integrated Thunderbolt cable, by connecting up to one of the Thunderbolt ports, I've access to all of these ports with just one cable. Now, just be aware that the M2 MacBook Air has a limitation where you can only connect up to one external display. So even though this has a display port and an HDMI port, just be aware that you can only connect up one display using one of these ports. It's a limitation on the M2 MacBook Air, not on the Travel Thunderbolt dock. And just to let you know, if you want to pick up the Travel Thunderbolt dock and you need a few V90 SD cards then we have a fantastic sale on at the moment thanks to our summer bundles deals. Next up it's time to talk storage. So the M2 MacBook Air has a base configuration of 256 gigabytes of storage which might be enough for some but if you are a content creator or like to store a lot of files then you're definitely going to want to upgrade it. However if you want let's say a terabyte of storage on the M2 MacBook Air, that is gonna cost you an additional $400. And well, basically you're stuck with it in that laptop. You're not able to transfer it to another computer or whatnot. So if you end up upgrading, you're gonna to have to spend $400 every time you do so. This is where the Sabrin Extreme Q SSD comes in. This uses Thunderbolt technology delivering up to 2,700 megabytes per second speeds. That is blazing fast for an external storage solution. Just by using one cable, you're able to access all of that speed also, if you are looking for a little bit of redundancy, then look at our 16 terabyte version, which has two 8 terabyte sticks inside. And because it has two NVMe sticks inside, you can configure it in any way you want, RAID 0, RAID 1, however you like. This Extreme Q Rocket SSD has been super popular thanks to its large cache size, meaning that you get consistent data transfer speeds. My second pick would actually be by using our Summer Bundles deal, by by getting yourself a Rocket NVMe 4.0 SSD as you get the USB 3.2 tool free enclosure absolutely free when you buy one of these. What I love about this kind of bundle is that this gives you up to 10 gigabit per second speeds thanks to its USB 3.2 USB type C connection and because you can swap out the NVMe SSD inside this thing you have as much modularity and upgradability into the future. I'll leave a link to this down in the description below if you want to go ahead and pick these up. And my last pick of the day is this Sabrent Safe Express card reader as this doesn't come with any card reader whatsoever and if you've got some footage to transfer off of a Safe Express card like this Safe Express card from Sabrent then this is going to be the perfect match because this has up to 10 gigabit per second speeds. This is also super portable as well meaning that you can take this anywhere you like. This Safe Express card reader is built really Really well thanks to its aluminium build so it's super durable and super rugged. It feels really premium in the hand and just to let you know if you want to pick up two or more of our CF Express cards we have a deal on where you can save up to 25% off. All of these accessories really maximize the performance of the M2 MacBook Air and won't limit you whatsoever. I absolutely love these accessories as they are built really well and work fantastic 
fantastic with the M2 MacBook Air. If you wanna go ahead and pick any of these accessories up, plus check out our summer bundles, then I'll leave links all down in the description below. But anyway, that's a quick roundup of my favorite Sabrin accessories to use with the M2 MacBook Air. Let me know if you've enjoyed this video by smashing that like button and leave a comment down below. Also, hit that subscribe button and notification bell so you can stay updated with more videos like this one. Anyway, until the next one, look after yourselves. Bye.